Hi students, it's Shayna, your teacher from EspressoEnglish.net, bringing you an all new daily phrasal verbs lesson. I hope you've been enjoying these lessons. I'm doing them daily only for the month of February. So if you'd like to continue your study of phrasal verbs, because there are a lot of phrasal verbs to learn, then make sure to check out my course called Phrasal Verbs in Conversation. You can get more information on that by clicking on the link in this video or in the description. So let's learn today's phrasal verb, which is nod off. Here are the three potential definitions of nod off. Remember, only one of them is correct. So as I describe the situation, start thinking about which option A, B, or C you think is the right answer, and you can post your guess in the comments, all right? So does nod off mean to complain, to fall asleep, or to get sick, all right? Let me describe a situation where I would use this phrasal verb. Let's say I'm in college and I have a lot of classes, but I also like to party with my friends. And one day I go out partying and we're dancing and drinking and flirting and just having a great time. And I don't get back to my dorm room until two or three in the morning. Well, the next day I have a physics class and I go to the class and unfortunately, the physics professor is really, really boring. Um, he doesn't make his lectures interesting at all. So I'm trying to take notes, but instead I nod off. Okay, I nod off in physics class. So based on this situation, what do you think it means to nod off? To complain, to fall asleep, or to get sick? I'll give you a minute to think about it, and then I'll reveal the correct answer. I hope you got it from the situation. I think it was uh, fairly obvious. I don't know. The correct answer is B, fall asleep. So I was out partying until very late, two or three o'clock in the morning. And then the next day when I went to my physics class and my professor was very boring, the lecture couldn't hold my attention and I was already tired. So I started to fall asleep. The, um, this is kind of funny, nod off, because the word nod actually means to do this with your head. We usually nod when we're saying yes to something. But sometimes when you're falling asleep, especially if you're sitting up, you kind of do this unintentionally with your head. Like, you know, you're falling asleep and your head kind of goes down and up. So to nod off simply means to fall asleep. We have another phrasal verb that means the same thing, and that's doze off, okay? Doze, D-O-Z-E, and then again, off. Doze off also means to fall asleep. So let's see if you can use this phrasal verb in your own sentence. Post a comment using nod off, or if you want, you can use doze off, uh, in the sense of falling asleep. I look forward to reading your comments. And again, if you'd like more information on phrasal verbs in conversation, or if you'd like to join that course today, click on the link and I will see you inside the course. Bye for now.